Dr. Mohan Kaur. I'm uh, Executive Chairman of Commonwealth Investment Corporation, and I'm speaking at the India Inc. conference on New Dawn for India as we go for a new Prime Minister in India. The new Prime Minister of India is a very good uh, news for India, not only for India, but India-UK relationship. As I um, wrote in Financial Times much before uh, the election results were out, I said Modi was the man for India and it, he is for free trade, free investment flows, foreign direct investment and he would be very good news for India-UK ties and I see India-UK ties sort of focusing on education, on trade, on services, on technology and on health uh, care systems where UK and India uh, companies can work together both in UK as well as in India. See a number of Indian companies who have um, listed on London Stock Exchange and all ba are based in London are now finding it uh, very easy for going and tapping into African market. So what I am looking at is the co cooperation between financial markets in London, technology and uh, um, expertise from India joining together to go to the Africa um, uh, continent. And again, the African continent needs um, healthcare, needs infrastructure, needs energy, needs education and technology. These are the two countries, the UK and India, are specifically um, sort of interested in education, in technology, um, and in research. And also uh, helping develop small and medium businesses. So I see um, a lot of collaboration happening, taking place between Indian companies and UK companies to tap the African market and also to help in infrastructure development in Africa. I think the, um, uh, Ms. Cameron uh, um, has a good friend and good ally in India now. And I think um, uh, Prime Minister of Great Britain is also very keen to improve um, trade uh, between India and um, and UK. And uh, uh, you know, it has not grown last few months, uh, years, but now it's likely to go. And there's a good chance for a service industry to be opened up in India. So the main uh, thing is probably to concentrate on through two or three areas um, which are in the manufacturing sector, in the services uh, sector, and particularly developing a strategic partnership between India and United Kingdom on research and development. And I think uh, higher education and research and development is the key for uh, concentrating on two or three areas of partnership between India and United Kingdom.